what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Alexandria here and our special guest, Daisy. I feel like I'm more of a special guest to her now. So anyway, I want to show you guys her closet tour. I've really been wanting to make this video and I've just been so lazy. So now I'm finally going to film it and show you all of Daisy's clothes. These are all of her clothes all of her goodies, all of her cute things that she could wear, and even some toys and like other stuff. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. So we've got this little skull bandana we just got from our bark box. So that's what we're wearing today, Daisy. And right behind little Daisy is her closet. So, size reference, they're both so small. Yes, we love it. Here is the closet in all of its glory. This is a doll closet I got from Target. So, if you wanna get the same one, it was at Target. I'm gonna start off right here. So, the first shelf, we have all of her extra collars. We've got this rhinestone one. This is her very first collar that the breeder gave us whenever we got her. So she doesn't really wear it anymore, but I love to keep it just in case. Next, I have this cute Henry Bendel collar. You know I love Henry Bendel and I love spoiling Daisy with it. So this is one of the bigger collars that she has. And then we have this little tiara. You might have seen this in my puppy haul like a long time ago, and it is so cute. Now, honestly, she does not wear it because she doesn't like to wear headpieces, and I wouldn't want to make her do anything she doesn't want to do. So, of course, I'm going to keep it because it's adorable and it makes her closet aesthetic. So, of course, it's gonna sit right there. So next I have this Victoria's Secret bag. So the story behind this tiny bag, I was shopping in VS and of course I saw this small bag and I was like, that looks like a perfect size bag for Daisy and I had to get it. Imagine if we're just like shopping and Daisy had this little bag. I know it's probably not realistic, but it was cute. So I had to get it and add it to her little closet. And then on the rest of this shelf, we have all kinds of bows. And some of these I got in the children's section and they have these clips, but she shakes them right out of her hair. So I would suggest getting these ones with the clips so that they're more secure. VS bag. So on this shelf, all I have is this big donut toy. I had this toy before I got her because I was like, you know, when I get a dog, I want it to have this toy. And yeah, so I just keep it in here for some reason. And on this one, this is like her, her little care shelves. We've got two kinds of eye wipes. I have these cat eye wipes, but they're gentle. So I'll use these sometimes. And then sometimes I'll use these. I don't have a preference. I would say these are like more wet and more foamy. And these are just like for gentle cleaning, I guess. Next, I have my Tangle Teaser that I use to brush Daisy. Then I've got these little clippers to cut her nails. And on the last shelf, we've got her deodorizing dog wipes. Excellent. off the back side so on the other side we have all of her clothes and a drawer first of all I have this little bio silk it's like dry shampoo for dogs. I just spray this on her and like rub her with a towel and it's kind of like a miniature bath. So I don't have to bathe her every day because she has so much fur. A little touch up is always a good idea. So let's start with the dresses. I have this one and this is like her little Christmas dress. 
but it's lightweight. So here is one of her summer dresses. I really love this one. It is so adorable and has tulle underneath. So it's extra puffy and it has cute little bows and diamonds, which I love. Then I have this one and it's like a t-shirt material and so it's really soft and really comfortable. I really love this one for Daisy so that it's nice and comfy and not as like stiff as the other ones. Next I have this really cute harness and this is one that she used to wear in the winter. I think this is a little too hot for her now. It's like 90 degrees outside in Texas so we're not going to be wearing that one for a while. Next, I have this one. You've probably seen this from my last puppy haul. It's been a while, but it's still a goodie. It's still super cute. And I don't know if the sweaters or the dresses are my favorite. Here is this really cute sweater with the satin bow. I'm just obsessed with these bows and diamonds. Next, I have this cute pink sweater. This one looks pretty small. But keep in mind, I bought most of these when I first got her whenever it was freezing cold outside and she was like super tiny with like no fur. And now she's got so much fur, I don't even know if she could fit into it. And by the way, the doll hangers that I got with this closet aren't like the best for dog clothes, but we'll make it work. Then I have this really adorable baby pink sweater with the bows and rhinestones again. You might have seen this one in my puppy haul as well if you haven't seen it. I'll link it down in the bio because it's adorable. She's like so small in the video. Next, I have these pajamas. Look at this onesie. Oh, it is so freaking cute. I got this at like Bed Bath & Beyond. Like so weird to find it there, but it's so adorable. And super soft. I want to get some more PJs for her that are on Amazon. You guys aren't ready for that. Okay, so look at this cute t-shirt for Christmas time. Who needs mistletoe with a face like this? That's just so adorable. Next, I have this really pretty Christmas dress. My sister got me this dress for her, and I'm pretty sure she got me this dress too. She gets so much stuff for the puppies. It's so sweet of her. So I feel like this one makes her look like a little candy cane. She wore this for her first Christmas. Whoops. See, look, it fell right off. Okay, we'll just do a little video down here. Um, this is a cute coat. It might be a little small for her now, like I said, but it's adorable. So it looks like she has a ton of clothes right here, but I really want to get her some cute summer accessories or little dresses. So let me know if you want to see that. She's got tons of winter and like no summer. So let me know what you guys think I should get her or if I should go shopping or not. Let's get into this bottom drawer. So I have these tiny doggy socks and they're just extra, you know, like she doesn't wear them, but hey, they're cute. I think they're adorable. And this one looks like a little ballet slipper. Oh, next I have this, this thing. This is like one of those. So this is one of those things that you would use like a laser and she loves it. Look at her, she's over here chewing on a piece of paper. No, 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 no. Hey, Daisy. Hey. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, oh, she finally saw it. Oh my, oh my, oh. She loves this little thing. It's so fun to play with her. She can be occupied for hours and I mean, so could I. We've got a little bone toy. Cute. And I have these little bandanas. You can change this one out for this one. And these are so adorable. I love these for like summer days. These are good summer, summer accessories. Then I just have a little leash. And I have her last Halloween costume. It's like some little bat wings or devil wings. So, 
That is all for her closet tour. Whoops. Okay guys, that is all for her closet tour. Really hope you guys enjoyed it and if you know any cool brands or like stores to get cute dog stuff, leave me a comment down below and I'll definitely go check them out. And let me know if I should do like a summer haul for Daisy since she has like barely any summer stuff. So yeah, we really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to follow us on our Instas. I've been posting on Daisy so much more now and we really hope you enjoyed this video. So she just jumped down. Well, I hope you doggy lovers really enjoyed this video and stay tuned for lots more fun and I'll see you later. Bye guys.